YouTube. Thank you for checking out this video. I'm very excited to show it because this video is found out by our good friend Atheos. Um, is basically how to lower your weapon over Xbox Live, which is the number one thing that 343 and Halo Wiki say you can do, which no one knew how to do. But Atheos does. So what we're going to do is show you guys how to do it. So here we are. Let's go ahead and start off, and I'll let Atheos explain it. All right, so you start off and you spawn your auto turret under Dominion and Forge, and you have to make sure it is set to your team. So we're the Team Rexes, Cyan Team Rexes. So we have it on Team 8 or 9, I don't know, I can't read. Team 8. And the team color as yours. So it's Team 8. And what you want to do is uh, build the turret about halfway. You'll see the loading bar in a second when he does it, I guess. Uh, you'll see the loading bar about halfway, and you'll want to go into Forge. It'll build the turret, and then once you leave Forge, you'll have a loading bar on your screen. And your weapon should be lowered. It is. So, that is so easy. It's extremely, and you're over Xbox Live right now. Look, at we're on Xbox Live. Yeah. They're not, we're not doing it. It's Xbox Live. It's legitimately this lowering your weapon. This isn't a LAN party. Not at all. What are we, like, nerds? Another thing is, when you move, your weapon is raised, mm -hmm. but yep. if you move slowly, looking around, pretty sure it stays down. It does. But, like, violent moves, it, it keeps yeah, it up. Yeah, slow moves. Yeah, nod, you can, like, the nod. go left and right really Yeah, you can slow. do left and right, and you do the nod for, like, to up and down for talking. I don't see it. You're not barely. very good at your nodding. <laughs> You're not good at nodding. Nope. There, uh, all right. You look like you have a crick in your neck. You're just like, I don't want to fucking up. talk right now. Like, I don't want to talk. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and so crouching, of course, it raises lower? as well. As Corey's. Yep, yep. Corey and his yeah. lowered weapon. So now I will show you a first-person view a bit, since you saw the third-person view. So we grab a turret, and halfway up, it builds, you drop, and you see a constant loading bar on your screen. And if they can say it, like everybody, all of us have our le weapons lowered. Yep. Yeah. It's, yeah. Yep, 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 yep. Now, just for clarification, does the weapon look like it's, you know, raised on your screen? It does. Okay. It looks yeah. perfectly okay. normal on your screen. So, another thing is, you can switch throughout the weapons. You know, you can change different weapons, but you can't shoot, and you can't throw grenades at all. And you can't press Y to switch the weapons. You can exchange them, but you cannot switch them if you have more than one in your in your uh, hands, you know, equipped it with you. So you can't shoot, yeah. you can't throw grenades, you can't switch, you can get on turrets, but it looks like you break your wrists, and you stay still, <laughs> but the turrets break your wrists. <laughs> <laughs> Look at your hand folded all kinds of backwards. And you can't shoot this one, you can shoot these, and it looks hilarious. But, and you can detach them, and it doesn't look anything different. Uh, one, one of the few things is that certain weapons, like the sword and the gravity hammer, they don't look lowered. Do not all. work. Does the rocket launcher look lowered? Rocket launcher is lowered, yes it is. And gravity hammer looks huh? completely cool. normal. Sword looks a little different. Somebody grab the, the sword. Oh, just so, for clarification on that, it doesn't really... It asks you to switch for the weapon really fast, but... Yeah, you kind of just hold X over yeah. it, because there's not really a... Hold X to swap until the loading bar finishes. And that that sword does look a little different. Stand still. Yeah, it seems like you're holding it kind of. It seems like you're ready to outward, just lunge. Awkwardly. It's not, yeah, you're gonna basically lunge. Yeah, it, it looks like you're you're in a lunge. Yeah. Yeah. Versus the normal, just which looks cool. Walking with it. And obviously, this is uh, big for machinima. Oh, of so. course, this is gonna be perfect for machinima's online. So you can actually have people, and you could, you know, I mean, just it's it's so much better. People, movie makers like me and everybody yeah. else know. It's just oh my god. So for like. For still clips and everything, where people are standing still, it's really it's good because you can do all the voice acting and everything right exactly. there. Exactly. Instead of trying to do it with four controllers on one Xbox. Yeah. Oh God, it was horrible. <laughs> and you could all run together. You know, yeah. it's like. Oh. Yeah. All right. Yeah. But again, so to wrap it up, I do want to thank you guys for watching this video. You know, please subscribe. It's really awesome. It helps out a lot. And be sure Go to check Rex. out any other videos. <laughs> Go Team Rexes, of course. Check out all the other videos in the bottom left, bottom middle, and bottom right. You can click on those buttons once I've uploaded the videos for them. Uh, be sure to check out the channel. I have a lot more glitch videos that involve Corey and Travis here. Uh, but yeah, really honored to make one of the very first, actually the first, online lowered Xbox Live weapon glitch. So yeah, thank you guys, and you guys are f***ing awesome.